Taste, welcome back to Mario the Music Box Arc. We're going to continue our insane playthrough right from the spot where we left off last time. We're inside the jail cell where Alice kept her mom. That's the mom there. She's all dead. Oh, God, she's been dead for a while. Okay. Oh, there's the flame that actually let me out. Thank you. Thank you, little guy. Okay, let's go up here. Oh, is this an exit? It is. Ooh. What's this? Oh. Oh, ah, clean water, finally. Oh, I'm healed, sweet. All right, back to full health. Oh, there's something glowing here. What's this? Obtained brooch fragment number six. Oh, sweet. Now it's going to be a flashback. Oh, happy birthday, Martian. I know how much you like birds, so I got you these binoculars. You can be much closer with them. Ha <laughs> ha, thank you, Luisiano. It's a great gift. I have something for you, too. Happy birthday, brother. Ooh. What is that? A watch? A brooch? What is that? Thank you. Oh. Marshawn, is this? It's a pocket watch. It's a family treasure. It originally belonged to my great-great-grandfather. My, I mean, our father gave me this when I turned 18. It belongs to you now. It's made of pure gold. Oh, that's a really nice gift. Oh. Luciano, what's wrong? Do you not like it? Martian, I can't accept this. Please, take it back. You said it was a family treasure, and I'm not family. I don't deserve this. Oh. Luciano, you are family, no matter what. Our parents may have abandoned you. We share the same blood. You are an evangelist. I see you as family. Never forget that. Oh, that's nice. Thank you, Marcion. I'll cherish it. Oh, that was nice. <gasps> oh, oh, there's a statue here. Whoa, whoa, what? Walla, Walla Ouija. <laughs> there's a statue on what? Oh. <laughs> oh, I can hit this over and over. <laughs> I don't know why there's a statue of Waluigi there. Cool! I have unlocked the door. Oh, I'm back in this. Okay. Uh, 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 goodbye. Oh, God. Oh, it's Marshawn again. Should I follow him? You guys are always yelling at me. You should save more. You should save more. So I'm going to try to do that. Oh, hi, little crow. Okay. The shadow went this way. Is it? Oh, there he goes. Where is he leading me this time? Should I keep following him? Uh-oh. Okay, let's keep following. I might die. I got to save, though. Okay. I'm not so scared now. I got it saved. Uh-oh. The wind picked up. Do you hear that? Uh-oh. There he is. Oh. This was the last place I said my final words. Marcion, I honestly can't pity you any longer. Oh. Your determination to be with Luciano again is all for nothing. This isn't your life anymore. Shut up. No, I will not. I'm sick of this place, and I'm sick of you. You just eat away at my guilt. This is my life, not yours. How sad. I give you a second chance, and this is how you repay me? No, it's not your fault, Mario. It's that witch that dwells inside you. I knew from the day I met Alice, she was going to ruin everything for me. I should have killed her when I had the chance, but the Lord would never forgive me. All you've done is ruin my life. Now you're ruining my second life. Just die, you witch. Feel my pain, you accursed witch. Oh, what? Oh, it burns. My throat, it burns. Why do you still cling on to life when you already messed up? I... <coughs> I gave you a gift! The gift of rebirth! 
It pains me to see that it was all thrown away to that witch. <gasps> What's so funny? <laughs> Don't forget, you're the one who's the witch here. <gasps> who was the one who performed forbidden magic for your so-called gift? You perform necromancy. <laughs> Remember who was the one who killed Luisiano? After what you did to all those people, including me, you deserved your execution. <gasps> Ooh, that hit a nerve. You always cry of how you miss your precious brother when you were the one who killed them in the first place. That's true. The realization, oh, how rich. You only made this poor soul suffer again with your mistakes. I knew there was a reason why I was able to possess this body. It's because Mario inherited your weak mind, your carelessness, and your sin. Shut up! My eyes. Huh? What just happened? Oh, meet me at the church when you obtain all the artifacts. I'll be waiting. Oh. Now, what was it? Oh, it's the guillotine! Holy crap! I didn't I didn't realize this is where they brought Mercy on the Oh Oh man Well that's not cool Now what? Do I go back to the town? Okay, let's go back. Oh Okay, this way I think, right? Yes. Alright, let's explore more of this town. We go down here, into this house. Ooh, now what's in here? Let's check out some stuff. Just a bunch of old dusty plates. Okay. Still more plates. A clock. Another clock which isn't working. Keep an ink over there. Oh, we can go this way. Okay. Hmm. Oh, goodness, the stench! It's a dead bird. The corpse is still fresh. Oh, did that kitty cat we <laughs> saw earlier kill that bird? Looks to be full of old porcelain dolls. Tacky. Nothing here. Oh, obtained red herb. Okay, that's good. That can heal me. Oh, a chest. Obtained ceiling charm piece. Oh, what was that? Ah, ah, crap. It's a little dude coming out of it. What the? Ah, oh, run! Run! What the heck was that thing that came out of the chest? Is he there if I go back in? Oh, I shouldn't open it. Oh, okay. I can't go back in. Holy moly. There was something crawling at me. Okay, let's go over here. Check this. Check this house. This game is so good. Okay, nothing. Stairs here. Ooh. Found greener. Okay. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, a chest. Obtained dispelled charm piece. That's two pieces I found. Oh, what is this? Here, kitty kitty. Oh, it's the cat. Meow. No. Well, is there anything you want as an exchange? All oh, right, it has the little piece. A brooch in its mouth. Oh, are you perhaps hungry? Here you go, a nice fish for you. Obtain brooch fragment number five. Sweet, we got it from the kitty. Huh. Why are you so selfish? I just want to help that poor child. You're the reason why she's homeless in the first place. Oh, it's Reba and Mercy I'm talking. You have a second house you're not even using. Why take hers away? That house belonged to my father. I'm not letting anyone else own it. Then why not just give this house we are in? If the other one means so much to you, why don't you move back there? Shut it! You don't know anything of what it feels like to live in that house. Just painful memories. He doesn't want to live there, but he doesn't want to give it up as well. You're acting like a child. Stop being greedy and give Alice her home back. No. I'm not giving that filthy family their home back. 
All they do is cause trouble to this town by spreading rumors about witchcraft. <gasps> rumors, eh? Then tell me, Marcion, why are you hiding your twin brother, Luisiano? Oh, Reba knows. Is that a rumor? Uh-oh. I know about him, Marcion. I know who he really is. I have your written confession, which I will show to the town. Don't say another word. Luisiano is not my twin brother. Stop being that child's lapdog and follow my orders for once. Ooh! Whoa. He hit him! Don't ever call me a lapdog ever again. Just for calling me that, I'm going to expose your bad omen. <gasps> oh, oh, crap. There you go again crying like a child. All you ever do is cry and play the victim. Haven't you learned anything? You don't deserve all the money and power you have. You just sit all day eating your precious sweets and do nothing for your people while they suffer. <laughs> I quit. Good luck, Marcion. You're going to need it. Oh, no, this is the end for him. Was another dream still? What the? Where is he going? What? Huh? I wonder where Marcion is going. He's going to the church. Where is he off to? Luisiano followed Marcion. So I followed Marcion at a distance. He started to climb the stairs of the church. I followed quietly. He was going up to the bell. Was he going to ring it this late? I felt a sense of dread, or maybe it was just the sound of the wind getting louder. Something felt wrong. <gasps> uh oh. Oh no. Marcion walked past the bell and went towards the ledge! Oh no! Perdomami mio signore. Forgive me, Lord. I watched him get closer to the ledge. It finally hit me. I now knew what his intentions were. He was going to take his own life. No, don't do that! Hey! Marcion! He didn't even turn to me. He was determined. Marcion! Fremente, stop! I ran as fast as I could, and I managed to grab onto Marcion's hand. Oh, oh, Marcion, why? Luisiano, let go. No, I'm not going to let you take your own life. Why are you doing this? Tell me. He stared at me with tears in his eyes. He knew what he was doing was wrong. Hold on! I... Climb up! Hurry! He's so heavy, I can't pick him up by myself! Oh, <gasps> Luciano. Put him in me. Forgive me! No! Oh! Because I didn't let go, Marcion took me down with him! We begin to fall from the church's top floor. They're both falling now. Uh-oh. I had to think fast, so I hugged Marcion tightly and let him fall on top of me. I wasn't going to let him die. Luisiano is sacrificing himself. I knew the chances of survival were slim. I'd rather let him live. He's important to many people. I'm just a nobody. I remember the pain when I fell. It was like a sharp stab to my back. Pain drifted away when I was losing consciousness. I thought this was it. <gasps> but I was still alive. <gasps> He's still alive. I kept hearing Marcion screaming my name until it suddenly stopped. I had fallen asleep. If it wasn't for Marcion surviving the fall, I would be dead now. His cries were heard by his maid, Aurora who then saved my life. I couldn't move or speak for a couple days, but Marcion was always by my side. I'm not religious like my older twin, but I believe that some sort of divine intervention saved my life. Something wants me to protect Marcion. Oh, so tell me, Marcion, why do you hate me this much? Oh, wow. Oh, oh. 
the cat left. I shouldn't worry about it anymore. I already got what I needed. Holy crap. The pieces are glowing. The brooch fragments have merged into Martian's brooch. <gasps> Obtain Martian's brooch. I have all the pieces now to unlock the barrier to the church. Oh. Okay. Let's go back out. Okay. Are you okay? Oh! Oh, oh. That's Reba. That's Reba. <gasps> hmm. What do you need? Martian? I have heard that name before, but I can't seem to remember. Oh, never mind. Oh, are you okay? Oh, I'm very hungry. Oh, let me see if I have anything to give you. Should I give him the chocolate? Uh, yes. Do you want your chocolate bar back? No, thank you. I don't like chocolate. Oh, he wants something else. Hmm, let me see if I have anything else. I don't. Okay, I have to find something for him to eat? Should I give him the chocolate? No. Hmm, what do you need? Alice. Oh, I don't really want to talk about it. I'm sorry. Okay, don't give him the chocolate. Hmm, what do you need? Okay, Reba. What about me? There's nothing special about me. Helena said, Who cares what that psycho said? I have nothing to do with any sort of cult or demons. Oh, now please drop the subject. Oh, okay. I have to find him some type of food. All right, let's continue exploring this village. What's in this room? Anything? Oh, oh, it's a flame. Oh, anything up here? Obtain green herb, okay. Any place else to go in this place? Nothing of interest here. Can't go up here. Can I go over here? No, I can't. That's it. Okay, check this. I can't check anything else. Okay, get out of here. Let's slowly check every house. Oh, there's something there behind the tree. Is that a head of somebody? Uh oh. There's somebody here. Oh, it's a ghost. I just want to say thank you. Oh. Is there any way I can repay you? I. Oh, she's missing an eye. Eye? Oh, you mean your eye. Do you need something for it? I could try to find something to cover it. All right, I have to find something for her eye. And I have to find some food for Reba. Oh, what's this? It's a rotten apple. I can't imagine fruit growing under constant rainy conditions. Perhaps there's fresh ones on the tree. Oh, climb. Climb. I don't see any apples here. Maybe they are up higher? Oh, go back. Oh, there's something stopping me from going up. Climb or climb down? Uh-oh. I think I'm going to die if I climb, but I have to take a chance. Let's... Okay, actually, let's climb down. I'm going to save it. All right, now I'm going to climb back up and see what happens. I think whoever's up there or whatever's up there is going to kill me. Oh, boy. Go back. Climb. Oh! 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 Yep! I'm dead! All right, I can't climb the tree. I get wrecked. Now, what statue is this? Oh, it's Marcion. Oh, that's cool. Okay, let's go in here. Check it out, this village. Oh, what's this? A very ominous yet beautiful flower glows in the darkness. I don't know if I should touch it. Oh, grab or leave it alone? Let's grab it, see what happens. Oh, I'm dead. Ah, oh, crap. This is a real flower. How could it have stayed alive for this long? Oh, goodness. This smells funny. Oh, sweet yet, yet. Achoo! Oh, my nose blew up or fell off. What? My nose, what happened? I'm bleeding. Oh, oh, my God. My nose exploded. Well, that sucked. I died two times in about 10 seconds. 
Okay, let's go back in here and don't touch the flower. Yeah, stay away from that. Found two times green herb. That's good. You, myself. Old used clothing. Nothing interesting. Okay. Found bandages. Okay. Bandages. Bandages. Maybe the bandage. Maybe that girl, the ghost, can bandage up her eye. Maybe it's okay. Let's go back. Let's go back. And talk to the ghost. Well, maybe I need an apple to shove in the eye socket. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let's go here. Would this be good? The bandages. Yes, for me? Here, take them. Oh, she bandaged up her eye. Thank you. Obtained two times red herb. Oh, she gave me some more healing stuff. Cool. That actually worked. Now, there's something up in this tree. I think there's going to be an apple up there. And that's what we have to feed Reba. I'm not sure how to get up in that tree. But it seems kind of important that I do. Okay. Let's go in here. Have we been in here yet? Oh, there's little hands moving around. What? Empty. Oh, don't get me. Don't get me. Oh, oh. There's more. Oh, there's more of them. Hmm, nothing of interest. Oh my god. Go away. Go away. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, what's this? This book looks very new. This wasn't here for very long. Oh, Origins of the Bad Omen. I'm the Bad Omen. Myself and my twin. Read? Okay, let's read. I've attempted to study the history of Evangeline. This place gives a very odd aura. Something about it doesn't seem right. Looking around in the residences, only a small portion of the legend exists. From what I have gathered is that twins born of the same gender is considered a bad omen and they must be drowned as they carry a curse. <gasps> the curse is said to cause disruption to the balance of harmony and chaos within the town. There has been numerous reported accounts of infanticide. <gasps> From this region, due to this bad omen, it was estimated around 20 twins which were killed. But the question is, what caused this legend to come? It is said twin sisters were born with unspeakable power eons ago. These said sisters were the first destruction known in modern times as the Ice Age. <gasps> These twins were said to have cursed all twins born of the same gender to cause dismay, just like they did. Their reasons remain unknown to this day. To my discovery, the last known surviving twins were Marcion and Luisiano Evangelisti. They seem to have sent away the younger twin. To prevent their names from being tarnished, they were the clergymen of this town at that time. Oddly enough, one twin didn't cause the destruction, the curse claims. Looking into Luisiano's past, he seemed to have suffered from the moment he was born to the day he was executed. This brings a theory. Only one of the twins is the one born with the curse, the younger twin. But it only becomes a disaster when both twins are together. Oh, that's why they separate them. This was noticed. Luciano and Marcion both started to cause destruction around them when they met as adults. The skeptics can easily refute this theory as just coincidental. But there's so much that needs to be explained. Toadstone. Okay. There's a path down here. By this hand. <gasps> Get into there. Oh, there's more hands. Oh. 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 Oh, this one doesn't go very far. Okay. By him. Good. Oh, there's more hands. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, there's two, two hands and a door. Okay, let's go by. Oh, there's another passage. Another door and some more hands. Okay, go up here. Oh, I can't get over there. Darn it. There's a... Oh, there's a chest there, too. There's a chest. There's two chests. One by the bed and one right in front of me. Okay. There has to be a way to get to that room. Oh. Okay. Right down here. Okay. Oh. Go! Okay, there's the room over there. Check this out. Found two times green herb. Good. Oh, it's empty. The bed. Okay, there it is. There. Oh! Oh, it 
looks like there's a false wall here. Go in. Is that how we get to the room? Yes, there you go. Yes. Oh, it's empty. There's the bed. There's the chest. Obtain dispel charm piece. Oh, the charm piece is fused into one. Obtain ceiling charm. Ceiling charm. Okay, empty. I got a ceiling charm. Oh, found two times green herb. Okay, let's save it and see what the ceiling charm does. Ceiling charm, a charm used to seal guardian spirits. That doesn't tell me much. Darn it. Go in, okay. Let's go back. Let's go back out. Guardian spirits. Huh? Oh, oh no, this is different. I don't remember this hall being so long. Which way do I go? This hallway is disorientating. Oh, disorienting. Oh, disorienting. <laughs> okay, let's go back this way. This is the way we I came, I think. Oh, oh, crap, that was the wrong way. Oh, what do we have here? Is the mask talking? The child doesn't seem to have a hint of life in her. What is a curious cat like you doing around these halls? Did you somehow wander in here? Oh, what exactly are you? That mask is really disturbing. Oh, <laughs> isn't it obvious? I'm a magical mask. I'm Vittoria, the master of drama. I was made to keep someone company. Oh, how wonderful he was. One day, he had died in an accident. His throat was stabbed with this very blade. Oh, no. Oh, how beautiful it was. Such an honorable death. Oh, but he left me behind, and this lovely child had found me. She saved me from my loneliness. We have bonded as master and servant. She's my lovely servant doing every action I do. Oh. Speechless, are you? Once I give you a beautiful death, you can be speechless as you like. Ha 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 get it? Yeah, I get it, you little freak. Hold on! Why do you want to kill me? I've done nothing to you. You dare defy me? That's right, I do. It's no use to reason with her. If I don't get away, she will kill me. Let's make this fun. I'll let you escape if you can make it to the end of this hall within 30 seconds. If you don't, the door will be locked. You will be trapped here forever. Oh, but you must be careful. There's traps everywhere. Now let's make this fun. Oh, crap. All right, I gotta save. Now she's chasing me. Oh, no. Oh, there's holes in the floor. No. No. Oh, God. Oh, oh it's getting dark. Uh oh, oh. Oh, no. What the? I can't see. Oh, go. Ten seconds. How long is this hallway? Oh, you little freak. Oh, here she comes. No. I made it. I did it. I got out of there. Did I make it? Hmm. Oh, thank goodness. Ho, 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 ho. All right. What else in this town haven't we seen yet? There's that darn apple just laughing at me. Have we done everything else? Have we gone in this house? <sighs> have we been here? Oh yes, we have. We've already been here. Okay. I think the only thing I haven't done or figured out is what to feed Reba. And the only thing else here is an apple. So it makes sense that somehow I have to get an apple for Reba. All right, let's figure out this apple thing. It's a rotten apple. I can't imagine fruit growing under constant rainy conditions. Perhaps there's fresh ones on the tree. Climb. Now, this is where I die. I don't see any apples here. Maybe they're up higher. Go back. This is what it always says. And if I climb, I'm dead. Maybe something happens differently if I keep climbing and keep dying? Climb. Oh, it's different. Ouch. The ceiling charm is burning. I needed the ceiling charm. It trapped the spirit that was trying to get me. <gasps> I can climb now. And there's the apples. I see some apples above. I should take one. Obtain apple. We did it. This is perfect. 
I've never seen an apple this big and nice. And now we, we, we feed it to Reba. I bet, I bet you we feed it to Reba. Okay, there's Reba. There's Reba. Oh, should I give him the chocolate? No. Should I give him the apple? Yes. Here, I brought you this. Is that an apple? I love apples! There you go! Here, take this as a thank you. Obtain three red herbs. That's it? <sighs> I'm a bit tired now. I'm going to take a nap. What? I do all that heat and apple gives me some healing things and then leaves? <laughs> oh, that's anticlimactic. I thought I'd get something sweet. <sighs> all right, let's go back out. Now, have we... I think we've done everything in this village. And I got all the pieces to unlock the thing to get to the church. Okay, let's go back. Let's go back to the actual town. And I think we can break the seal and get to the church. Okay. I think I got all three pieces. Oh, uh oh, oh. Why did it get dark all of a sudden? Uh oh. Is something bad going to come out of that hole and get me? Oh, go! Go! Why did it get all creepy all of a sudden? Okay, we're here. We're here. Okay, go up here. Does it break? The artifacts are glowing. It's going to break it. Uh, yes! Ah, that must have broken the barrier. I can proceed. There you go. Oh. <gasps> Oh, it's freezing cold. Brr, I can't back away now. I've made it this far. Okay. Gotta go this way. Gotta make it to the church. This way. Then it's to the right. Then up. Then over. Oh, boy. Up. Over. Uh oh. Up. Oh. And then it's over to the left, right? Past these trees. Oh, there we go. There he is again. And then up. Okay, let's save it right here. Oh. Here we go. Now, let's go forward. Oh. Yes, we made it to the church. Can we save it again? I want to make sure I save all kinds of times. There we can. There we go. All right. Now, the next thing we do is go in the church, and we'll do that in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I love you guys. I'll see you next time, all right? Bye-bye. Yeah.